Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Hello, DC family. So I'm saying DC family because it's Danielle Cavanagh's family. That's the name I made up. It has been so long. The last time I posted a video was in March. And I don't even think I posted my birthday video. It was supposed to be a glow up video. Like, Danielle, what happened to the glow up? Like, what happened? <sighs> so, um, I was kind of like high functional depression, I want to say. Um, and I did not know I was depressed until like, maybe till like a month and a half ago. Um... Y'all know how much I love my plants. Um, Y'all know how much. Yeah, like really like I love my plants. And I should have known then. But again, I was distracted with things and people that I just didn't know. I'm just functioning. I'm just doing things for other people, doing things for me. And I'm just doing things. And I'm just going about it day by day. And I'm just realizing that I fell off track um I have not watered well now I watered them but um before that I stopped watering my plants my babies was dry like I haven't watered them in months and I should have known then that boom red flag something's wrong but I did not notice my house I did not have the energy to clean up at all so my house was super messy and my therapist always say like you know how your mental health is um going depending on how your house look and it it was not going great but I was just kept on existing and kept on you know doing things and um I guess like my mental health really suffered it really like trickled like low low even my garden I had a garden well I still have my garden but um I have not been in my garden for a long time and I stopped taking care of my garden I had tomatoes I had cucumbers um what else I had um what is that called peppers bell peppers I had jalapenos I had a lot of things growing in my garden but the mosquitoes was like yo far rockaway mosquitoes like they don't care if you got off they don't care if you got any clothes on. I used to go out there with a hoodie, clothes on, like if it was like if it was winter time. A hoodie, clothes on, two pants, like serious, like off. You had to spray off on you like every 30 minutes because them mosquitoes are brutal. They did not care. And also that just stopped me from going to the garden. Period. Um and just <sighs> getting myself back so one thing I really wanted to do was YouTube videos I wanted to be consistent that's my one thing in all my life that I have to struggle to work on being consistent I'll have this like oh my god this is great this is amazing I'm motivated and then it's like crash and this is great this is a crash da -da -da. and there's like this yo-yo of yeah no motivation no motivation no, 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 no like and i definitely want to work on that and i want to stop um really i just want to work on being consistent let's not say stop and put like we're human but i want to definitely be consistent so that's what this channel is about. I am going to be doing a whole bunch of things. My family be like, Danielle, you think you know everything. Like, um, you can be a lawyer, a hairdresser, a business person, a this, a that, a that, a that, a that. Like, yes, I can do it all. I like to um, diversify. So um, I don't want to limit my channel just to hair or locks or um, cleaning videos or... I just don't want to limit my channel because it's gardening or plans. There's a lot of stuff that I like to do. So I am going to make a commitment to myself to post videos consistently. I don't care if it's once a week. 
um twice a week just as long as it's consistent you know of course good content but of course consistent so um i'm happy i'm doing this video now because if i would have did this video like a month ago sis would have been crying so my mental health is really better it's better it's not great but it's, it's i'm doing better i'm trying to find more meaning in things um because that's what we're here on earth to do right like i really just want to be happy and find stuff not find stuff but really just like work on being happy live my life with intention with high vibrations and as we get into this digital world it's so easy to just shell the way and be on your phone and be on instagram and youtube oh my god youtube i get sucked into youtube but get sucked into youtube and not really connect and like socialize so i kind of want to do that more connecting socializing like coming together getting off the phone um i want to do that more but right now i feel like i'm just rambling but um that is where i have been um and we about to get our snit together so how have you guys been um wow it's been march so it's wow it's almost the end of the year that's crazy that is almost the end of the year i feel like the time has really went i feel like it was just my birthday Tom has really went but i'm looking forward to catching up with you guys please leave in the comments down below what have you been doing um how have you been feeling how was your summer um was you depressed like me <laughs> um was you high functioning depression like you know how are you guys feeling um I feel like in this whole time i have been recording videos but i just haven't been posting it but i feel like in this time i don't know if this even makes sense but i kind of been called to do youtube by god i know by the divine i know that sounds crazy but um like i get signs from I look at everything as a sign really like everything happens for a reason and because it's supposed to happen like i really live by that like life is happening for you not to you and the universe is always working in your favor and like i'll watch youtube videos and i think her name is kelly stamp i think her name is kelly stamp and she's like you could do youtube like if i can do it you could do it then i watch something else and it's like oh i had this goal um for 15 years and i crushed it out in two years and it's like or three years and i just been watching youtube videos and they really kind of been speaking out to me like and the video is not even about like oh how to start a youtube channel or how to become successful on youtube these are just regular videos that i'm watching about something else and they just happen to throw that in there and i'm hearing it too many times in my brain and i feel like Who knew I was going to get emotional? I'm a crier. I'm a big crier. But I cry for happy things, blessings, um, sad things. I'm a crier. But I feel like the only thing in my way is me. The only, the only thing in our way from greatness is me. And I think I seen that on one video once a while back. She was saying how like... You know all of this is achievable but you're in your way like nobody can make you do things like you really have to just get out of your head and get out of your own way really because whatever you want to do you want to be a writer you want to make comic books you want to be a model or a youtuber or whatever and it's like we are in our way like we have a choice we can either watch youtube videos all day or make youtube videos and edit we can play games all day or like apply for jobs or play games on youtube like we can either be whatever on instagram 
or if you want to be a writer actually take some time and write or you know make the content that you want to make or really like if you want to learn a different language instead of watching tv you can actually practice that language so we are it's our fault basically it's our fault and we need to change it and listen we can change it together like leave in the comments down below one thing you want to change and i feel like i um i don't know if i could show you but on the wall let me see if i could show you okay don't mind my bed but up there right it says um it says i am a full i am a successful full-time day trader and i want time freedom and you know and i want to be stable that was on january 15th 2021 so at the beginning of this year that was my goal ask me what did i do to achieve that goal i made investments in bitcoin and ethereum and you know i'm not doing great but i'm doing okay like um but Am I a full-time day trader? Do I have time freedom or even close to it? Um, I guess I do have some time freedom. But um, am I close to Am I stable? Like, what did I do to... What did I do to go, you know, down that road and nothing? I, I, I did absolutely nothing. Um, I did nothing. And sometimes it's hard to hard to actually look at yourself and be like, okay, what do I need to change? You know, sometimes we like to blame people. Like, I can easily be like, oh, I was around this person and I did everything for this person. And now I have nothing to show for it. I can easily blame that person. I can easily blame like, oh, I was depressed or, I mean, hmm. Or, oh, I had anxiety or oh i had work or oh i had like you could easily put it on a whole bunch of things but sometimes you just need to look in the mirror and look at yourself like what did i do what did i do to achieve that goal and the answer is nothing because you could have i could have instead of doing this i could have worked towards my goal and i didn't so i definitely want to start working towards my goal and it starts with this video um and really like i can't do the same thing over and over again expecting the same results like i just can't like i left my job in march because of i was not happy and um my goal is really to help people <laughs> It sucks because I'm just talking to y'all, but it sucks because um I'm stopping because I'm getting emotional and I don't want to cry. But every time, okay, I can't promise you that I'm not going to cry more because I try to get it a little bit out of my system. But every time I, um... I talk about this like what of course we all trying to find our purpose but every time <clears throat> I talk about this thing I always get so emotional which I know like this is what I'm meant to do and I just really want to help people and at my job it was a nonprofit, and I just feel like I wasn't being helpful anymore. Like, yes, I was getting paid a decent wage being in New York City um, to really, like, have to stay in the office and basically don't do a lot. But at the same time, like, I was, I was wasting my time. I didn't feel like I was helpful. Like, I wasn't helping people. Um, I know for me, the job changed my life, but it got to a point where it's just, like, it's just numbers and i just wasn't being helpful so i was like you know i'm not happy because I'm not helping anyone and um so i left but I, my bigger goal really what i'm really passionate about is homeless people like i 
I want to um and you know I want to have buildings and um maybe like tiny houses and houses to really help homeless people like homeless families um really have forever forever homes or not even forever but like stable that's the word i'm looking for stable homes because the system is so bust up and put you through hoops and hurdles and there's no reason why in new york city that um hra is paying for uh three hundred dollars i mean three thousand dollars a month for y'all to stay in a hotel room when rent is fifteen to two thousand dollars like all right maybe it's not fifteen no more but the two thousand dollars when you could be in your own place and they could be helping you with that and it's like they rather pay pay a hotel shelter like it really doesn't make any sense to me but that is really one thing i'm passionate about i also feel like i have a lot to offer the world and i've been through some things and around a block so i think i can teach people and people can learn from me and i can learn from people and i'm off topic you know i'm, I'm gonna talk about this in another video but all to say is welcome back to my channel um let me know what i want to see in the comments down below um i'm gonna say one thing i'm grateful for one thing i am grateful for today is um really getting up i got up i meditate i felt like a different energy today like a different energy i was been supposed to make this video um maybe like a month ago and i haven't i just had I, I didn't make the video and today i really felt like let me put down my phone let me leave my phone let me do something for me i did my hair me and Clyde been eating healthy and let me just really do something for me so i'm happy that i made this video and really had the the energy to um make this video so please leave one thing down in the comments below that you're grateful for and i can't wait to see you guys um in the comments and in future videos and um it wasn't like i was some big youtuber or something but i just like disappeared like and i was so happy oh my god i think i got like 70 something people watched the video like people think that's little but if you was in a room with 70 people it's like that's a lot of if 70 people came to my party like it's lit like i'm happy so i'm definitely happy for for that so more videos has come they're already recorded and some of them already edited um so yeah so please give this video a like um comment down below and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys next time bye